Well, hello there. Welcome back. My name is Julie and I am on a keto adventure. Uh, this is my keto journal and I am checking in. So, as far as nutrition and being on the keto plan goes, I have been doing pretty darn well. Not perfect, not amazing, but pretty good. As far as exercise and being active goes, I have been killing it. I have been tearing it up. I am so sore. Um, I am so just physically burnt, <laughs> but um, also feeling really good about it because like every day I have a little more energy, even though I'm stiff and I'm sore all the time, I have more energy than I did before. Um, what am I doing? Well, if you watch our, our like main channel, our dumpster diving channel, then you'll know that um, I have been working in my attic uh, at home, cleaning it out. Oh my goodness, just trying my best to just empty it because it has, well, it got to a point of just being seriously, like literally dangerous. And um, so I've been cleaning it out. And so it's up and down a ladder, up and down a ladder, carrying stuff. And oh man, it has been so tough. And not just that, but also carrying stuff outside for the yard sale or carrying it out to donate it or carrying out to throw away or anyway, just, and then moving stuff around in the attic and all of it involved has been insane. But a good thing that's come from it, well, many good things, I feel like it has been really good training for trying to go hiking again. I have not attempted to hike since uh, I hurt my ankle, you know, a couple months ago, whenever that was. And um, now that it is completely healed and I've been doing this work and it still feels good and all the up and down and up and down, I mean, I feel ready to get out there and hike. And it's just in time because the heat wave is supposed to finally for reals break this weekend so I can get out of a, of a beautiful fall morning, get up into the mountains and do some hiking. Stay tuned. My goal is to do that on Friday morning. That's, that's the plan. And I don't see myself, um, not holding to that. The one tricky thing is I usually do my stuff in the attic first thing in the morning. Otherwise it's just too freaking hot, you know, but, uh, I do need a break. I definitely need a break. And so, um, and, and hiking has got to be in the morning also because yes, it does get hot. And plus I need to be at home in the afternoons for my kids. So that is what I'm going to do Friday. I can definitely take a morning off from doing the, the attic and with how hard I've been working up there. I mean, we've made major progress. There's still work to do, but it's, it's not at a point that it's like overwhelming, you know? Anyway, I am feeling good. Uh, just, you know, this, this has been way more, this attic cleaning out thing has been way more of an emotional journey than I had ever anticipated. And it just, you know, finding things that I'd forgotten we had or having to sort through mementos and memories and, and all of that, along with the just being physically and mentally and emotionally exhausted, all of it together, uh, wow. <laughs> it has been very therapeutic, very cleansing, very difficult. I've had to deal with some seriously difficult uh, feelings, but I am proud to say that even with the most difficult of them, I did not fall back into my unhealthy stress coping mechanisms that are related to the eating disorder. I did not fall into that and I count that as absolutely a win. So that is where I am at today. Please tell me in the comments how you are doing with uh, your own health and life goals. I want to be able to support you. Have a wonderful day. We'll see you soon.